everybody, it's me, Jasmine Janice. I came through with another video. I was really happy with this look, as you can see. I didn't edit any of this in the beginning because I wanted you guys to see how stupid I am when I'm like trying to film for these, like the after shots after I'm done filming. And I really liked my wig I had on, so I was doing the most. But um, I hope you guys like this look. And I was really excited to film it because I just got off of work and I just started filming and it turned out really really good for the time I had and how tired I was as you can see I was just extremely tired doing dumb dumb stuff but stay tuned and hopefully you guys enjoy this look So this was the only thing that I kind of sped up my brows. Um, I did them kind of off camera and I started my voiceover for this because I was taking so long talking about nothing when I was doing my brows and it literally was the biggest struggle. But it took my brows actually took me a really long time to get done for whatever reason and I um, just wanted to show me finishing them up. I usually don't use that much concealer, but uh, sorry, my son's in the background like watching me <laughs> voice over this, but no, um, I just wanted to show how I was getting them done, I, but I usually don't use as much concealer on my brows, so when I actually do my primer, you're going to see me just like do the bottom half of my face because I just use so much concealer, but yeah, I just wanted to show my brows and they actually turned out really good when I got done. I was really happy with them. But I really, really wanted to, so here I am. I'm gonna put on my that's that I'm gonna put on my foundation that I didn't have. Oh okay. foundation, of course, it is spice rum if you've watched like all of my videos. Because I started filming right after I bought this, so I'm gonna buy more foundation tomorrow, I think, but uh, for now, this is my Holy Grail foundation. And I actually wanted to um, purchase the James Charles palette that just came out, like, I think like yesterday. Yesterday or the day before, and it's already sold out. Like, I'm really annoyed about it, but it should be back in stock and then I'm going to buy it and film with it. It's really nice palette and I really want to use it. And I watch a lot of his videos. He's pretty amazing. all my brushes are done. First, since I already set my concealer on my brow with me on my eyelids, I'm gonna take my Juvia, all oh, the Masquerade Mini by Juvia, and it has all my little bright colors in here. I am gonna take, <laughs> let's take Zobo, that's what it's called. This Purple right there. It's like dark pink purple. Whatever you know you want to call it. And I'm gonna do it right above my crease. But there's that Zobo right here. And that's what it looks like showing up. 
and uh, like I said, I just pack it and I really make sure it's there to really come up in my looks because when I do color, I like to, oh, here's a little closer. But um, I really want it to show up and look really good and I flipped it out some because I don't quite know what I'm gonna do with my eyeliner. If I'm gonna do a black eyeliner, I'm not gonna take that same brush, I'm gonna take a different brush. If you like it really lazy, but I'm actually gonna go with an even like tinier, denser brush. It's good for blending though. It's uh, this is by Elf. Elf brushes are like really nice to use. I I want to use probably. I'm gonna take this. I didn't want to take Makita, this purple, or this darker blue. I'm trying to think of, I'm probably going to do the purple. And I'm like actually going to really not dig in, I'm just rolling it in there to get it on my brush because it's so good. But it has a tiny, it's like a little, it's like metallic y. So it's making me scared to use it. The way I'm going to use it because I feel like it's more of an eyelid color. You're about to see. So, sorry, I don't want to get too close and make the light go more funny. But. Oh, I don't know. This should be fine. I just really hate to take like a metallic color and like blend it in my crease. Yeah, I don't, because at this angle, and I'm going like me look straight on. It looks real crazy. But then when I blend it out, it won't look as bad. But what we're gonna make it work. I'm gonna pack it on. Which is surprising. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna take a clean, another dense brush, and I'm actually gonna dip into this chai. Yes, I'm gonna dip in because I'm actually gonna use one more transition color, and then I'm gonna do one of these three. For my um, lid, small little lid color, and then do my um, waterline with a certain color. Now, the only thing with me and Chai and Makita, when you see it on here, they're obviously this is purple, this is blue. But when it goes on, you have to be really careful how you put this on, or they're gonna just look like the same color. So I'm actually going to go and really pack this underneath it like a lot and I'm it looks like it's just blended in there. Oh my gosh. But I'm like But it has enough that it has the blue, the purple, and the fuchsia on there. And I just open it up some. And I will take a flat brush. Personal preference, I'm going to take a flat brush. It's from Morphe. This is the M210. And I think it was like $2. And I'm going to spray it real good. 
and even though these show up this these show up really good I'm probably gonna use Zola mm, I want to use Delilah but this or Dayla sorry so I'm gonna use the Zola and probably hopefully not regret it I feel like I should have just used the blue. I might just mix them. Yeah, well it's green and it's making me hate life. I'm just gonna mix, mix it that blue. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back with my chai and make it a nice halo effect. Which for me stands out more. I'm actually probably gonna wet my brush a little more and really pack it on there. This middle color so it stands out because it's kind of trying to mix, it with the, mix them together again. It's trying to like blend in with the you already have one. And then I go back with my blue and try. Let me get the center of my eye. And I think that looks a lot better. I like it. All that matters. And I think it looks really good the way it is. Am I probably going to do the blue underneath? And what? Try to use that pink, but I'm probably not going to. I get real ambitious, and then I'll mess up a whole look. I'll mess up a whole look. People will be looking like, why did you even do that? I'm like, I have no idea. This blue has me shook. I really like it. Woo! And I, but I really like this blue. But I'm actually gonna mix it with the Makita, of course. I look like so much down when I see it back, but you can see that actually looks like and. To do my trick up. <sighs> These rooms be scary. They're just sometimes they're like, people use them, I'm just like, oh, it's cute, maybe I can use it. And then I use it, I'm just like, hey, I'm not charged. Green it. Let's try. I only really have like, got some sweat in it. I would do that Molly, but I'm gonna try Zola again because it's still a little blue.
By the way, if I'm not pronouncing these right, which I still 99% sure I'm wrong. Um, my bad. But yeah, with the model that looks better. But um, let's add a little of the Giza. Let's actually, this is Giza. Let's actually do that. Let's do the heat. The highest. Oh. This is what it looks like on my brush. Ooh. It might be too dark. Alright, let's mix it with Giza. Let's see what So I tapped into it and just gonna. Yeah, I need my brows done so bad. It's, it's ridiculous. Mm. Terrible. It makes it makes my brows look awful. I try to do so much with them. Let's go back with the Zobo. Yeah. Make sure I didn't lose any of that. But yeah. Excuse my brows, they're usually never this sh like sharp and like boxy right there. I really don't prefer that. I like it without eyeliner because then you can still see my eyes. And I think it looks pretty well. So I'm going to wipe away this side because, I mean, that bake was, was way too long. But I never bake my face anymore. Uh, once I contour and everything like that, and clean this part up, we're just going to do the other side. And I will. So here is the final look. Um, it actually turned out a lot better. <laughs> I know I always say that, but yeah, I don't plan any of my um, looks. So this actually turned out a lot, lot better than um, I planned. Here it is. Oh, I might actually have to. I don't know if that's like helping or not, but close up on my face. Um, like I said, leave a comment, uh, like and share, subscribe, 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 please. Uh, I will be posting hopefully more this weekend and a little bit around Thanksgiving because I have time off. So, yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Talk before the moment slowly zips away